This is WVUA 23 News at 10. Good evening, I'm Sarah Macaluso. Jabari Pruitt has the night off. Thanks for joining us. And what a week it has been for the Alabama Crimson Tide. Tuscaloosa has been in full celebration, to say the least, since their win against Clemson last Monday night. WVUA 23's Yasmin Panetta has more. The Tuscaloosa Strip was only one area that celebrated the Alabama football team's 16th national championship win. On January the 15th, Target held a photo op for fans to come in and take their picture next to the trophy. From Target all the way to Bryant-Denny Stadium, fans from all across the nation have come to experience the excitement in person. Some will even stick around for the national championship parade next week. You walk on the campus and it's like electric. Uh, you feel it. I was just telling my daughter, I said, I feel like the walls are talking to me. You know, and it's, it's kind of powerful. The Alabama football team will be honored for its win with a parade beginning at Denny Chimes on Saturday, January 23rd. They'll be here. Be more than happy to be here. And I've never experienced that, but I'd like to. Fans are already anticipating what's to come for the next season. Nick Seaman's a great coach. You know, he, he molds the players. And, um, you know, uh, so I, I think they'll be okay. Um, you know, maybe a, maybe a repeat, but uh, it'll be definitely tough. Clemson's got a lot of players coming back too, so uh, it should be a good season coming up. For now, fans are anticipating the parade, and there is still plenty of space for future championships behind Nick Saban's statue. Reporting from Bryant Denny Stadium for WVUA 23 News, I'm Yasmin Pineda.